During the invasion of the trees, Danny learned about Clara's secret adventures with the doctor. After marking her student's schoolwork and writing some sticky notes, Clara was prepared to tell Danny the truth. While he was out walking, she phoned him. She began to tell him about her recent travels with the doctor and that she loved him. However, the line fell silent during the call. A panicked woman took the call and informed her that Danny had been hit by a car. Clara rushed to the scene in time to see Danny's lifeless body being taken away by paramedics. Several days later, Clara attempted and failed to blackmail the doctor to save Danny's life. The doctor still agreed to use the telepathic circuits to find a way to save Danny. The TARDIS took them to 3W. They were greeted by Missy, who said that she was a greeting droid and passed them on to Dr. Chong. Dr. Chong established a communication with the Nether Sphere, and the voice of Danny came through. The doctor left with Chong to investigate the center while Clara spoke with Danny. Clara asked Danny to say something which only he could say so that she knew that it was definitely him. She vowed to find a way to be with him, even if it meant taking her own life. In fear that she would die for him, Danny repeatedly told Clara he loved her, prompting her to end the call. Turning around, she found that the dark water had drained from the tank containing Dr. Scarosa, revealing him to be a Cyberman. To save herself, Clara used her knowledge of the doctor to try to convince the Cyberman that she was him but ultimately failed. However, another Cyberman stunned her, killed the others and took her to a graveyard. In the graveyard, Clara avoided the Cybermen rising from their graves and her savior revealed itself to be Danny. However, Danny couldn't stand the pain of being a Cyberman and asked Clara to activate his inhibitor for him. Clara activated his inhibitor to allow Danny to clearly see the Cyberman's plan and afterwards hugged Danny who retained control even with the inhibitor due to his love for her. As Clara hugged Danny, Missy, who was in fact a female incarnation of the doctor's boyhood friend the Master, arrived to reveal her plan was to convert all of humanity and have them march across the universe, conquering and converting, an unstoppable army, with the only question being whether that army spread on its own or the doctor took control of it himself. During the confrontation, Clara got a hold of Missy's weapon, while the doctor handed control of the army to Danny. Danny then sacrificed himself to stop Missy's plans. However, the devastated Clara decided to kill her out of revenge. The doctor decided to do it to spare Clara from being tainted, but they were both spared when a rogue Cyberman appeared to disintegrate Missy with his wrist blaster. Two weeks later, Clara awoke to Danny's voice and followed it to a portal. Clara was excited as the doctor had told her that Missy's bracelet, which Danny had on him, would thus allow him to come back. However, Danny chose to send back the boy he killed, asking Clara to get him home as there was only enough power left for one trip for one person. Meeting with the doctor, Clara nearly told him about what happened with Danny when the doctor assumed he returned and she would be ending her adventures with him for a life with Danny. However, she stopped herself when he told her that he had found Gallifrey. Clara said goodbye to the doctor and watched him depart once more as she didn't want to spoil his happiness.